a state anywhere in the grandstand. There are people on the top of the grandstand, so it, it, it's amazing. And we, we look forward to that, and that's why we get so real excited about races such as this, the Santa Anita Derby, as we start off the post parade with flashback Bob Baffert, the West, Garrett Gomez, recent second in the San Felipe. And one horse has come back and won on that race already. Scott Omega Star was seventh, and he came back to win. That's a good sign. He came back to win. Only horses run back so far out of the San Felipe. Power Broker, five to one. This is his three-year-old debut. First start since a fifth place finish in the Breeders' Cup Juvenile. Back on Lasix after having to come off it on just that one day. Tis a minister at 12 to one. Finished third in the San Felipe, and he was closing. Win, lose, or draw. Owner Stephen Young and Paul Aguirre made a hell of a play. They paid 40000 for this bull last August. He's banked 282000 There's Golden Sen sitting at 5-1. to one. You know what, Scott? The basketball and horse racing gods are smiling on Rick Patino because it's almost half time of the Louisville Wichita State game. And the team, Patino is part owner of Golden Sense. It's going to be perfect timing for the race at halftime so for Mr. Patino. The halftime speech will be put on hold until after the Derby. Absolutely. Absolutely. Super 99, you heard from Martin Garcia. His best chance is to go their summer exclusive. He's got one start. That was a win. He'll take the blinkers off for a second career start. I don't know if he can win, Scott, but he's going to have an effect on the race because he's a fast horse and he's going to be in the pace for sure, even though the blinkers come off with that one ball auto. There's Hall of Famer Gary Stevens, nine-time winner of the Santa Anita Derby. 12-1 to 1 is what his mouth sits at. He's getting better, but he's going to have to step it way up to compete with these horses, in my opinion. And Dirty Swag, 45-1, to 1, longest shot in the field. He's won for eight lifetimes. He is the longest shot in the field for all the right reasons, Scott. These connections, though, Mont Club Show, the owner of Reader Trainer, they have popped the big numbers in graded stakes before. So they have done it before. It would be a surprise if this horse doesn't. He just looks a little bit slow. So eight horses will line up. One mile and one eight will be asked of them in the great.